So we know it's essential to get enough protein in our diet, especially when we're going through the perimenopause and menopause. And that's because our bone density is decreasing, our muscle mass is decreasing, and protein helps with both of those, but also because our hormone leptin is decreasing, which is the iron 4 hormone. So we want protein to trigger that. But I hear you cry, how do I get enough protein in my diet without having to you know, eat all your meats and fish and dairy and things like that? Well, I would recommend that you get a good quality protein powder. Um, and this doesn't have to just be taken with water. It can be added to the smoothie, like I have mine every single morning. Or it can be added to things like Greek yogurt, make sure it's low fat and low sugar. Or you can add it to your porridge every single morning, especially as it's getting colder in the winter months. So I just wanted to say that that's a quick and easy way to up the amount of protein that you've got in your diet. And I'm more than happy under here to put the protein powder that I use and that I recommend. But let me know, do you find it hard to get enough protein in your diet? All right, lots of love.